Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Crypto. A very important moment for Luna Classic before we begin. Do not forget to join our monthly subscription, Patreon slash Mind Crypto. You can find the link in the description box and in the comment section if you are going to take easy profits, trading 200 altcoins and many, many other benefits. Thank you for watching. Let's go right now very, very quickly to see the targets of Luna Classic. So it turns out that this was a bullish pennant indeed going with lower highs, higher lows coming after an uptrend. But right now we want to see the next price targets. What are we going to do and in which targets we should be focusing on? For the time being, we are having a plus 8% in the 4-hour frame and here is one of the most important targets along with this one right here in the low non-logarithmic scale. So I'm going to have these lines okay, as a very, very huge resistance level area that if we can close above these lines, then we can go towards the next price target, which is way, way far more than the 0.3028 that LUNC does have now. So for the time being, we are finding a little bit of the strength to move upwards. Some of the times we are going a little bit down. Some of the times we are going a little bit far upwards. If we go to the 15 minute mark, you can see that we are struggling right here, but we are consistent, okay, and keep getting even, even higher. Now in the four hour frame, we need to close above these targets, always remember, closing above means that the closing, okay, the C of the candlestick has to be above these lines and especially the highest one, okay? So we cannot ignore the 0.30s, 28187 to 19 around there. We need to close above and then we can go towards the next price targets, which we are going to call right now. The first one will be the 0.30.32.179 with the possibility of going even, even higher. However, right here, you have to see that we can go all the way up to the 0.30.41. Yeah, that's right. If we close above these targets, we can go into parabolic mode, going all the way up higher into the 0.30.32 into the 0.30s, 40, and so on, okay? Because these targets are very, very important. They are playing a very important role. Now, can we have something like a bursar, say, divergence back here, for example, forming a higher high pattern, or eventually like a double top, and then we fall down? Maybe we can, right? If we close above these targets, maybe we can go towards the, the first target right here, and then we fall down, forming in the RSI a bearish RSI divergence. Anything can happen, but for the time being, I have to tell you this. Closing above these lines will get us for sure even, even higher towards the next price targets right here. For the time being, we are look like we are looking like we want to go even, even higher. We are looking like we want to go above the 0.30 279, the 0.3028, and close above these lines, which is very, very important. But I would wait personally, for the four hour frame close. Okay, the four hour frame close will be very, very important into seeing if we can manage to make it on. If we close below these lines right there, then we are going to go back into the 0.30, 26, 5, 7, 5. Okay, so personally, yeah, it could be possible that we go down to the 0.30, 26, 5, 7, 5, maybe going all the way up higher to the 0.30, 32, if we close above these lines and even even higher towards as we talked about the 0 0.3036 and so on so it is very very interesting to see that for the time being we have broken above from the bullish pennant now the next thing we want to see is how far we can go for example this was the bullish pennant right here you can see that we have broken above we want to see right now if we are if we can manage to go all the way up high right here into these targets or we are going to find rejection either way for the time being luna classic is looking good but at the end of the day as i talked about i would wait personally for the closing above conditions because if we do not close above there is a huge chance that we drop again down to the 0 0.30.26575 and many long positions will get very very wasted okay and we will see liquidations from many many long positions anyway for the time being let's see how Lunsi will react in to the 4 hour frame, we do not have a huge, huge risk. You can see the RSI still sitting below the 70. So yeah, 
we could be growing even even more with the technical analysis as with the price analysis i'm having these targets on my mind i personally i'm going to have a buying or a short order based on these targets right here not financial advice of course nothing in this video are financial advices and do not forget to join our monthly subscription patreon slash mind your crypto thank you so much for watching have a fantastic day and see you soon bye